Hi everybody, my name is Chelsea. I work for Better Body Foods and welcome to the very first episode of our brand new YouTube series called Ask Me Anything. PB Fit, if you haven't heard, it's the freaking best peanut butter powder around. Um, our customers love it, we love it. I'm super excited to talk about it and take your questions so that you can love it even more. Uh, I'm pretty much PB Fit fan numero uno. You guys send in your questions on Twitter, on Instagram, on Facebook, email, you can call us um, and all of that magically prints out in our magical uh, mailbox that we have right here. The flag's up, that means we have some questions. And so let's go ahead and take some. From Julia from Miami. Um, and this is my favorite, favorite question, so I'm glad this one came first. Is PB Fit for smoothies only? Definitely N-O, no. PB Fit is for anything that you like to put peanut butter in and maybe some things that you've never thought about putting peanut butter in. I actually like to sprinkle PB Fit on my popcorn. I make it into a sauce. Um, I mix it with water, almond milk, dairy milk, anything like that, any liquid of your choice, and make it kind of thin and pour it on ice cream, which is kind of just an excuse for me to have more ice cream in my diet, which I think is never a bad thing. Don't tell uh, the nutritionists here at Better Body Foods, but I love ice cream. Um, you can cook with it, you can bake with it, just replace some of the flour in your um, in your baking recipes with some PB Fit to make peanut butter brownies, cookies, muffins. Greg, just from California, don't know where you are from, Greg. How do I use PB Fit to make regular peanut butter? This is a great question to go along with that. A lot of people don't know you can use PB Fit to make regular peanut butter, to just make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, um, make it a dip for apples, carrots, anything like that. Um, so our directions on the bottle recommend that you start with two tablespoons of PB Fit and then one to one and a half tablespoons of water. The beauty though of PB Fit is you can make it whatever consistency that you want. So that's going to make it a pretty thick creamy consistency similar to a regular creamy peanut butter. If you want it a little bit thicker, a little stiffer, um, if you're like going to make a sandwich out of it or put it between graham crackers, it's one of my faves as well. Um, I make it a little bit thicker, add a little extra powder or a little less water, or you can make it thinner. Weston here in uh, Salt Lake City, Utah. I don't know if you guys know we're here in Utah. Can I pre-mix my PB Fit? No, we've designed PB Fit to be preservative free. Um, and while we can assure the stability and the shelf life of it while it's in the bottle, once you add water, you're adding all kinds of germs, maybe particles of other food. We don't know how clean your stuff is. We can't guarantee how safe it is. So you mix it up, eat it when you want it. And don't try to save it for later. I don't know if you just heard that. Somebody was trying to come in, craft our video shoot. Um, this is actually the second shoot that we had to do the first time we weren't recording. Silly John. Um, and while I know you, this says, are peanuts used in PB Fit uh, tested for aflatoxin content? Aflatoxin content, sorry, it's a tongue twister. Um, and the answer is yes. So if you don't know, peanuts are highly susceptible to a mold that produces a chemical called aflatoxin. Um, it's a pretty serious concern with any peanut product, and we take it very, very seriously. So we test all of our incoming peanuts for aflatoxin, including B1, B2, G1, and G2, which are all different types of the chemical. So we just want to make sure we're giving you um, a tasty product, but also one that's going to be uh, safe for you and your family. Did I get any paper cuts with these? From Molly in Michigan, I like the alliteration. Is PB Fit gluten-free? The answer is yes. Our PB Fit meets all, meets all the standards for FDA gluten-free. However, it's not certified gluten-free. So if you buy some of our other products, you will notice that there's an NSF gluten-free certification logo on there. We're working on getting that certification for our gluten-free as well. As of right now, it's not. Hopefully next time we'll be able to update you and tell you that it is. But just look for that certification logo if that's something that you're interested in. Otherwise, we do meet the FDA standards and definitions for our gluten-free products. And like I said, check out our website. Um, you can go Twitter, Facebook, to Instagram. We're gonna have a chat function on our website. You can give us a call, an email, write us an actual letter. I know, I don't know if people really do that anymore. Just send it to Better Body Foods and we'll get your questions and hopefully you can be on another episode of Ask Me Anything. You can be famous like me. PB Fit used to have 85% less fat, now it's 90% less fat. What changed? We routinely do nutritional analysis on all of our products. Um, because we do a lot of organic and natural products, there is some natural variation. So we want to make sure that we're getting a really accurate picture of what our nutritional facts are so that we can be honest with you so that you know what you're putting in your body and what you're consuming. 
So we did do a formulation change about a year ago where we switched from a cane sugar to an organic coconut palm sugar um, in our PB Fit. So we did do some retesting at that point um, and that test confirmed that we could now say 90% less fat. Um, so we made that change. Lucky you, the flavor's better, the nutrition's better. Uh, it's delicious. Jacob from Idaho Falls. Uh, where are your peanuts sourced from? So we source from a couple of different places. Here in the United States, we source from Georgia and Alabama. And then we also source from uh, some peanuts from Argentina. Okay, this is our last one. Why do you add salt and sugar? For traditional peanut butter, I'm like you. I just want ground up peanuts, no sugar, no salt. However, we can't do that with PB Fit. When we press out the oil, we're pressing out a lot of the flavor from the peanuts. And the peanuts get a little bit bitter. Um, so in order to make it, you know, something that you guys actually want to eat, we do have to add a little bit of sugar and a little bit of salt. Um, we decided it was better to sweeten it ourselves because we can have a lot more control and add just a little bit. Whereas we think if people sweeten it at home, they're going to add a lot of sugar. So we want to give you the, um, the tastiest and the most nutritionally beneficial product that we can. So we've kept that sodium and sugar content really low. We do use a organic coconut palm sugar, so you're getting a more natural sugar there. All right, guys, this is all, they're all gone. So I'm just waiting for you to tweet out your little questions and fill this mailbox right back up. Um, it's not just about our PB Fit. Check out our whole product line. You can um, ask us questions about anything. We're happy to answer them. We'll see you on our next episode of Ask Me Anything. Watch for us on YouTube. You can subscribe to our channel right here. Also visit our website, betterbodyfoods.com. We have tons of information, tons of recipes. You can check out all of our new products. We launch all of our new stuff there on the website. Um, so just check us out there. Uh, for now, this is the end of episode two of Ask Me Anything.